Hello, awesome learners. This is Morale, and you've just landed on another exciting adventure with Learn with Morale. Today, we're going to talk about something that powers everything around us. Imagine your favorite toys, the lights in our schools, even the expressions you make when you're surprised or laughing. All of these things need energy. But where does this energy come from? We call these energy sources. So buckle up as we dive into the world of energy, exploring fossil fuels and renewable energy sources. Imagine this, dinosaurs once roamed our Earth, and now we use their leftovers as energy. Yes, you heard it right. These leftovers are what we call fossil fuels. Picture them as buried dinosaur snacks. Sounds funny, huh? But it's true. These fossil fuels, like coal, oil, and gas, are formed from the remains of ancient plants and animals. They've been hanging out underground for millions of years, just waiting for us to discover them. And we've put them to good use. We burn them to create electricity that powers our homes, schools, and even amusement parks. They fuel our cars, buses, and planes, taking us on all sorts of exciting adventures. And let's not forget, they help cook our favorite meals, making sure our pizza is hot and our ice cream stays cool. But wait, there's a catch to these fossil fuels. Our fossil fuel party might not last forever. Why? Let's find out. Now imagine you're at a birthday party and the cake is disappearing slice by slice. That's kind of what's happening with our fossil fuels. They're like the birthday cake and we've been having a grand old time, but they're not infinite. So as we use them, they're slowly running out just like the cake at the party. And it's not just that they're running out, there's more to the story. You see, when we use fossil fuels like coal, oil, and gas, we're also creating a lot of pollution. Picture it like a party popper, but instead of fun confetti, it releases smoke and other harmful substances into the air. This isn't good for our planet or for us. So, what do we do? Well, we need to find a new type of cake, one that won't run out and doesn't make a mess. We need something unlimited and clean. Let's meet the Renewable Energy Squad. Introducing our superheroes, the Renewable Energy Squad. Sunlight, wind, water, and earth heat. Let's meet them one by one, shall we? First up, we have Sunlight, the Radiant Power Provider. This bright star sends us warmth and light every day. With the help of solar panels, we can harness this energy, turning sunshine into electricity. Next in line is wind, the invisible force. Have you ever felt a gust of wind on a breezy day? Wind turbines capture this energy, spinning around like a gigantic windmill, generating power as they go. Jumping into the scene is water, the flowing force of nature. In places with rivers and waterfalls, we use hydroelectric dams to convert the rush of water into electrical power. Last but not least, meet Earth Heat, the underground powerhouse. Deep below the Earth's surface, there's a whole lot of heat, which we can tap into with geothermal power plants. These renewable sources are our ray of hope for a cleaner, brighter future. Now let's take a ride into the future. Picture this. Cars zooming by, not on gasoline, but electricity. Backpacks not just for carrying books, but also soaking up the sun to power your gadgets. Even playgrounds with swings and slides, producing energy as you play. Wow, can you dream up more incredible machines powered by the sun, the wind, or the water? Imagine a world where everything runs on clean green energy. Pretty cool, right? Let's quickly fly over what we learned today. Fossil fuels like coal, oil, and gas are like underground dinosaur snacks that power our world. But they're limited and can create pollution. On the flip side, we've got the Renewable Energy Squad. Sunlight, wind, water, and earth heat. They're nature's endless power sources that help us create clean energy. Now, here's a challenge. Can you find examples of renewable energy in your daily life? Remember, every time you switch on a light or play with a toy, you're using energy. So let's make it clean and green. That's all for today's adventure, awesome learners. Thanks for joining our journey into the world of energy with Learn With Morale. We've got plenty more exciting lessons in store for you. Stay curious, keep learning, and see you in our next adventure. Bye.